Hey, welcome back to my channel. So today's vlog, you'll probably see me in the morning, but it's going to be bright and early. So I'm going to do a hyped intro right now because I feel like when I start my videos off when I first wake up they're boring so I'm just sitting in the parking lot of the Chinese food restaurant and I'm just gonna pre-film but today is the day I am going to Boston what you'll see is I'm going to Boston for our Christmas I got Bruins versus Maple Leafs tickets at the garden which I'm so excited because I love the Bruins I'm a New England girl Bruins were my first team I ever loved but I also love the Maple Leafs I know a lot of people ask me why I don't just love the Bruins, but I love the Maple Leafs too, and they're doing so well this season, so are the Bruins. So my parents and my brother are coming with me, and we're staying in a hotel overnight, and we're spending the weekend in Boston. So I'm getting on a train bright and early at 8.39 in the mornings when my train leaves, and I'm going to Boston for the day. So I wanted to take you guys along, do a little travel vlog, do a little Boston weekend in the life with me. Um, you'll get to meet my brother and my parents, and I'm so excited. I am having a little bit of a dilemma of what jersey to wear because I have my Rosk jersey and I have a Maple Leafs jersey. But I don't want to get beat up in Boston for wearing a Maple Leafs jersey, but I also want to wear the Maple Leafs jersey because they're one of my teams. But I don't know, and I don't know how the game's going to go because they're both doing great this season, so I'm really excited. But I can't wait for you guys to come along with me on my journey. I love taking the train. So, yeah, stay tuned for the rest of the video and for the weekend fun we have planned. Uh, maybe I'll throw in a little hotel tour. Um, but, yeah, I'm so excited. So stay tuned and I will bring you right along to Abby when she wakes up at the butt crack of dawn. <laughs> Today is the day. I look like trash. I'm so up. I can just stop saying that about myself. Today's the day. It's the Bruins game day. And it's Boston weekend. And I'm really excited. And it's looking at my watch like I have it on. I think it's like 7.20 right now. And I have to leave here by 8.10. So I'm gonna go curl my hair, throw makeup on, get changed, make sure everything's packed, and head to the train station so I can go to Boston. a little cold. It's a little cold out here. But we're at Quincy Market in front of the Boston sign. What? So I don't know what's going on. Don't want the picture taken. Yummy. What? Twelve dollars. Only twelve dollars? Where's Austin? We just got to our hotel. We're in the Hilton in Cambridge. Austin's coming in. My parents have a room across the hall. We're in this room. We're getting ready. We're gonna put some clothes on. We're gonna go explore the city before the game. It's 3.44. Game's not till seven, but we did a little exploring today. You guys saw it, but it was cold, so we came back, and then we decided why are we sitting around when we're in Boston. So we'll give you a little room tour. We'll check in with Austin, get a little fit check, and then we'll go back to they're pretty snazzy. We got a little bathroom. Hey. And two beds. And. Hold on. Oh, the view's great, but it's snowing. I love our little Boston view. It's snowing out, though, so it's a little chilly. <laughs> this man is still going. I just saw a man's pee pee out my window. <laughs> Full blown dick saw shot. His pee -pee right out of oh, also our view is pretty great. <laughs> I'm traumatized of his pee pee. Oh. 
Fit check. We have the Maple Leafs beanie. We're supporting both teams. Bruins jersey, jeans, and leggings because it's cold. Austin, give us a fit check. Yeah, 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 pasta. Fit yeah. check. It's just showing me what your outfit is. Let me see. Turn around. Let me see the names. Yup. Perfect. Bruins. Hey. a little bit of little clips oh my god i'm so tired it's 10 43 um 143 i love you um it's 10 43 we just got home from the game it was an amazing game it was 3-3 tied for in the third bruin scored the winning goal with like a minute left on the clock there was a huge fight there was almost a bench clear fight crazy honestly and it's two of my favorite teams so i was really excited to go and I got like super upset during it. I don't know why. I've just been feeling like that recently. But we picked it up. I sat with my dad, my mom, and my brother, and we met people around us. It was super fun. I did change my hat because I didn't want to get like beat up in TD Garden. Not saying people would beat me up, but hockey fans are brutal. And I saw how they were treating other people, so I didn't want to do that as well but i had a really fun day um with my parents and my brother in boston i don't know what we're doing tomorrow i might update you in a new video or i might just keep this video but i'm gonna take a shower and get in my jammies and eat snacks because i'm hungry but i had an amazing time and i'll definitely be going to another bruins game soon with abby and renee because i love the bruins and it was my first time in td garden honestly Fantastic. I wouldn't have asked for a better experience. I am a little sad my Maple Leafs didn't win. But I was telling my mom that I always had this thing that I'm like, people are going to think I'm dumb for liking two teams. But honestly, there's no rule that says I can't love two teams equally. And they're both very good teams this season. I will forever be a Bruins girl because I am a New England girl. And Bruins were my first team that I ever fell in love with. But I love the Maple Leafs as well, and they have some great players. So I'm gonna like both teams, and I don't really care anymore. <laughs> and I know I'm just rambling on now because I'm tired. But I'm excited to see what happens tomorrow. I'll probably do, be a new video. Um, but yeah, that was my day. I'm gonna take a shower and I'll check in with you guys before I go to bed. Wait, before I get in the shower, I forgot to show you guys what I got at the pro shop because I saved like all of my money for the day. Like I didn't spend it in any of the other stores cause we walked around Quincy Market and like Faneuil Hall area. And I saved my money at those stores cause I knew we were gonna go to the pro shop and I got two shirts and a sticker. These shirts are sick. Um, honestly, I'll explain, but this one was on the clearance rack and it says Boston Bruins. And it's the support, we support our troops and it has the American flag on the sleeve. And I was like, that is sick. And I love like black t-shirts and I love anything like supporting the military. And then I got just the basic Bruins shirt, but it's the pasta shirt, which I love. Um, I was gonna get Charlie Coyle because I love Charlie Coyle. And then I was gonna get McAvoy because I also love McAvoy. And then I was gonna get DeBrusque because those are probably my top four players is Pasta, Coyle, McAvoy, and DeBrusque at the moment, but Pasta's just been killing it. And honestly, I love him. So I got the Pasta shirt. Cause I already have a Bergeron shirt. But the fact that this one t-shirt is $45 made me like sick to my stomach, but it's really cute. And I was, I wanted a Jersey but jerseys are like $260. So I'm gonna save up to get another jersey because this one's a Rosk jersey. And I want like a current player, even though I love this. This is my first jersey I ever got. I do want like another Bruins jersey or I really want an Austin Matthews jersey, but I'm kind of on a Bruins kick because I was just at the game. But 
I got this pasta shirt. And then I got, lastly, I couldn't not get a little bumper or a little car sticker. My mom was like, do you want a car decal? And I was like, yeah. So I'm gonna put this on my car. Um, <laughs> I hope I can put it on my car. I don't really know if I grabbed the right one or not, but it's okay, we'll figure it out. Um, but yeah, that was my little haul from the pro shop. Now I'm actually gonna get in the shower and just, I'll update you guys before I go. All right, hey y'all. So I just got out of the shower and I actually went over to my parents' room. They're across the hall. I'm sharing room with my brother. Um, I just went over to my parents' room and they, had some snacks so cheese crackers chips hummus pita just like some little munchy snacks um we didn't want to spend too much money at td garden because it was kind of expensive honestly i wasn't shocked there were the pretzel was like six dollars alcohol was obviously expensive um and then i got like a frozen minute made lemonade which was like 11 italian ice and i think that was also six dollars so it wasn't too bad um but i didn't really get any food before the event i just got french fries in this little like restaurant hub they have under the garden in north station um but yeah i just wanted to end the video here because i'm not sure if i'm going to film tomorrow depends on what we do and i'm not sure if i want to make it its own separate video so i'm ending the video here Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed coming along with me to the Maple Leafs Bruins game this weekend. It was my first game ever at TD Garden and it was actually my first NHL game ever. I've been to um, like the Wolf Pack and a lot of college teams, but I have not been to an NHL game before. And it's definitely will not be my last. I'm actually planning on going to at least one or two more this season. Um, of course, like the train's going by right now, but I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did enjoy and want to see more from me, definitely hit that thumbs up and that subscribe button. I am, have a lot of videos planned for the next couple of weeks and I'm excited to edit and upload them. Um, yeah, I'm just excited to be here and I'm on my journey. Um, I'm sitting by the heater right now because it's 74 degrees I set it to because I'm just freezing all day. Um, but I will turn it down in a second. But yes, anyway, um, the most important thing is chase your dreams, follow your heart, and shoot for the stars. Bye, guys.